glasses for the monk's mind glass for the soul of Patrick D'Souza, the souls of John Chitia, Mary and Francis D'Souza, Charlie, Duyak Naigo, Thomas and Philip Hendricks, Stephen, Rocky and Gabriel D'Souza, Ida, Michael, Rinwal, Christopher, Cecilia and Tony D'Souza, Paul, Frieza and Clement Fernandez, Charles and Irene Montero, all souls, and there is also a thanksgiving march. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit, we are here, we have to acknowledge our sins, and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. Lord Lady, I confess, I confess you Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask this Mary of the Virgin, all the angels and saints, and to you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me in the Lord our God. May Almighty God mercy on us. Forgive us our sins and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. May the Spirit of the Lord be praying and give us powerful with spiritual gifts that He may give us a mind pleasing to You and graciously conform us to Your will. For our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lived and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the Act of the Apostles. In those days, desiring to know the real reason why Paul was being accused by the Jews, he unbound him and commanded the chief priest and all the council to meet. And he brought Paul down and set him before them. Now when Paul perceived that one part was a and other were Pharisees, he cried out in the council, Brothers, I am a Pharisee, a son of Pharisees. It is with all respect of whom of all the resurrection of the dead that I am on trial. And when he had said this, the dissension arose between the Pharisees and the Sadducees, and the assembly was divided. The Sadducees say that there is no resurrection, nor angel, nor spirit, but the Pharisees acknowledge them all. Then a great clamor arose, and some of the scribes of the Pharisees' party stood up and contended sharply. We found nothing wrong in this man. What if a spirit or an angel spoke to him? And when the dissension became violent, the tribune, afraid that Paul would be torn to peace by them, commanded the soldiers to go down and take him away from among us them by force and bring him into the barrack. The following night the Lord stood by him and said, Take courage, for as you have testified to the fact about me in Jerusalem, so you must testify also in Rome. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The response. O God, for in you I take refuge. Can you repeat? O God, for in you I take refuge. Preserve me, O God, for in you I take refuge. I say to the Lord, You are my Lord, O Lord. It is you who are the portion and cup. 
you yourself to rescue my lord a response preserve me o oh god for in him i take refuge i will bless the lord who gives me counsel who even at night directs my heart i keep the lord before me always with him at right hand i shall not be removed a response preserve me o oh god for in you i take refuge and so my heart rejoices my soul is glad even my flesh shall rest in hope for you will not abandon my soul to hell nor let your holy one see corruption a response preserve me o oh god for in you i take refuge you will show me the path of life the fullness of joy in your presence at your right hand bliss forever a response preserve me o oh god for in you i take refuge hallelujah hallelujah may the holy one this as you father are in me and i in you so that the world may believe that you have sent me says the lord hallelujah the lord be with you and with your spirit a reading from the holy gospel according to saint john glory to you o lord at that time jesus lifted up his eyes to heaven and prayed saying I do not ask for these only but also for those who will believe in me through their word that they may all be one just as you Father are in me and I in you that they also may be in us so that the world may believe that you have sent me the glory that you have given me I have given to them that they may be one even as we are one i in them and you in me that they may become perfectly one so that the world will know that you sent me and i love them even as you love me for i desire that they also who you have given me may be with me where i am to see my glory that you have given me because you loved me before the foundation of the world o righteous father even though the world does not know you i know you and these know that you have sent me i have made known to them your name and i will continue to make it known that the love with which you have loved me may be in them and i in them the gospel of the lord praise to you lord jesus christ blessed are you lord god of all creation for the goodness we have received to break the yoke of you through the dear the work of human hands it will become for us the bread of life blessed be god forever Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for to your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the wine that work of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and good of all the souls of church. Graciously sanctify these gifts, O Lord, we pray, and accepting the oblation of this spiritual sacrifice, make of us an eternal offering to you through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. He is so divine and just. Our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, we give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord. 
For after his resurrection, he plainly appeared to all his disciples and was taken up to heaven in their sight, that he might make us sharers in his divinity. Therefore, overcome with possible joy, every land, every people exults in your praise. And even the heavenly powers of the angelic hosts sing together the unending hymn of your glory and the acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed it comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fall of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, the gifts we by sending down the Spirit upon them like two form, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and gave thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, once more giving thanks. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith, when we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim your death, O Lord, until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you all the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that your friend is worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. How may we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world, and bring her to the fullness of charity, to give Francis our hope also in our vision and over the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy, Lord, we pray, that the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, the blessed Joseph, and the blessed Apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, may be merited to be co-heirs to eternal life, and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him, and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. And the same is command, performed by the divine teaching. We dare say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray for every evil. Graciously grant peace in our faith, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we are the blessed hope and the coming of our Saviour, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom and the power and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I give you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but in the faith of your church, and graciously grant the peace and unity in accordance with your will, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other's hand and peace with you. The Lamb of God, who take away the sins of the world, and have mercy on us. The Lamb of God, who take away the sins of the world, and have mercy on us. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, grant us peace.
Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy of that which you have done, and I do. But only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Spiritual communion with the Lord. O oh Lord Jesus, since I cannot now receive you in your sacramental presence, I beg you to come spiritually into my soul, to enrich me with your holy grace, and make me truly your own forever. O oh Jesus, living in Mary, come and live in me, in the spirit of your holiness, in the fullness of your power, in the communion of your mysteries, in the perfection of your ways. O Divine Guest, give to my soul a strong, lively faith, an unbounded trust, perfect humility, an abiding sorrow for my sins, a total abandonment to your Divine Will, and a perfect loving union with you in mind and heart. O Sacrament Most Holy, O Sacrament Divine, all praise and all thanksgiving be every moment thine. Lord Jesus, thank you for the blessings and graces you have given me through this spiritual communion. Let us pray. With the mysteries we have received, O Lord, we pray. Enlighten us by the instruction we bring, and restore us through our participating participation in them, that we may merit the gifts of the Spirit through Christ our Lord and the Lord be with you. And with your spirit in your mind, God bless the Father. The Son and the Holy Spirit, Amen. The Mass of Him, the Holy Peace. Thanks be to God. Navina prayed to Saint Jude. O Lord Jesus Christ, who went on earth, lived with a strong cry and tears, offered our prayers and supplications to your heart, received the offering of His service, during which we desire to join our prayers to yours for these intentions. Mention the favor you desire. Together, we make this offering to Mary, your mother, and to Saint Jude the Radius, your beloved cousin, for he is the helper in difficult cases. For their sake, accept our prayer and render them fruitful. Amen. O glorious apostle Saint Jude the Radius, patron of hopeless cases, who was chosen by God to give testimony of the true faith, suffered all kinds of tortures, and in the end gave your life rather than deny your faith. Obtain for us a faith strong as yours, and like you, make us ever ready to confess it with joy, so that we will die rather than deny it. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, and the Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us, who has now the hour of our Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be born without the Saint Jude, pray for us. O faithful apostle, Saint Jude, the Reyes, beloved cousin of our Savior, by the admirable courage with which you sacrificed your life, sooner than fail in your fidelity. To the true God and true faith, obtain for us the grace to be always faithful to God and to the Church in all our duties, so as to merit a share of glory in heaven. Our Father, who art in thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, our task is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, and we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord. 
Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and this is the fruit of thy Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Saint Jude, pray for us. O fervent apostle Saint Jude, pray for us. Whose only desire was to please God in all things. O pray for us the same desire, that we may live with the same fervor. We may spend all our life in working out our salvation, so that purified by the fire of revelation, we may be invited to the eternal crown of glory in the kingdom of God. Our Father, who art in heaven, thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, now and ever, shall be the world without end. Saint Jude, pray for us. Let us pray. O God, who through the blessed apostle Saint Jude has brought us to the knowledge of Your name, grant that we may celebrate His eternal glory by making progress in virtue and by perpetuating the glory we may advance in sanctity through Christ our Lord. Amen. Pray to Saint Jude, most holy apostle Saint Jude, faithful servant and friend of Jesus. In the name of the Creator, who delivered the beloved Master into the hands of his enemies, has caused you to be forgotten by many, but the Church honors and hopes you universally as the patron of hopeless cases, of faith as well. Pray for me, who am so miserable. Make use, I implore you, of that particular privilege accorded to you, to bring visible and speedy help where help is almost despair. Come to my assistance in His great need. That I may receive the consolation and succor of heaven in all my necessities, tribulations, and sufferings, and that I may glorify God with you and all the elect throughout the world. I promise you, O blessed Saint Jude, to be ever mindful of great favors, and will ever cease to honor you as my special and powerful deity, and to do all in my power to encourage devotion to you. Amen. They shall lay hands on the sick and they shall get well. Grant Almighty and eternal of all of heaven us to help those who believe. They are us for the sick, for whom we implore the aid of your tender mercy, that being restored to bodily health, they may give thanks to you in your church through Christ our Lord. Amen. May Jesus, the Son of Mary, the Lord and Redeemer of the world, through the merits and intercession of his holy apostle, Saint Jude, Show us favor and mercy. Amen. May the blessing of Almighty God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit descend upon you and remain with you forever. Amen. Saint Jude, pray for us and all who invoke your name. Thank you for your love. 